today I'm going to share with you um, one of my favorite vegetable that we find a lot in uh, Switzerland, uh, also in Europe, I guess, and America and some other more countries. So uh, we are going to see how to make this uh, vegetable that that's also called um, leek in English. So yeah, this is the one. This is called leek in English and poro in French. So uh, I'm going to make uh, this vegetable in Indian style in my uh, um, Kathiawadi style. For this, we are going to need poro, the leeks, then uh, some garlic and garlic, you can call it chutney, garlic paste. Uh, I made it with mortal and paste still. And uh, I've just put some chili powder in it. You can uh, skip this if you don't like garlic. Uh, but if you like garlic, you use garlic a lot, then I would suggest you to use this because it's going to taste delicious. Apart from this, I'm going to use uh, onions that are shallots and uh, I'm going to get them peeled and I'm going to cut poro in small uh, slices and I'm going to show you how to um, make them. Okay, see you. Um, so I have cut my vegetables um, in this way. I hope you can see them well. Uh, they are nice and green and fresh. And uh, I have peeled the shallots. They are about a um, handful, maybe 150 grams. And uh, about two tablespoons of garlic paste. And this is a half a kilo of vegetable. So I'm going to quickly show you how to make this vegetable. It's very easy and simple. Okay guys, so I'm putting about uh, 3 to 4 tablespoons of oil. It's peanut oil. You can put whichever you like. About half a teaspoon of mustard seeds. As soon as this splatter. I've put some hing. And very little jeera, one fourth. After that, I'm adding these and, and now the paste they have already got fried because my temperature was too high but uh, we will wait for about 2-3 minutes after we put them and since mine are already fried I am putting the for so now I am going to put the poro, uh, the leeks. So now we will, um, after mixing it well, we will cover it for about 2 to 3 minutes maximum, not more. Cover it and cook for about 2 minutes. So after about 2-3 minutes, you see the vegetable has started moving water. And we are going to stir it. But we will cook it for another 15 minutes. And uh, before we finish cooking, I like to add uh, some kind of, you know, beans in it, like edamame beans or. You can also add corn, boiled corn, canned corn, or you can add uh, to make it more Indian style. You can add chana dal. That will also taste nice but in when you add chana dal you have to either 
कुक इट सेपरेटली बॉइल इट सेपरेटली एंड पुट इट और यू इन तड़का यू फर्स्ट पुट चना दाल एंड कवर इट फॉर अबाउट टू थ्री मिनट्स देन यू पुट फॉर द लीक्स अदरवाइज दे वॉन्ट गेट कुक प्रॉपरली हैंडफुल ऑफ एडमा में बीन्स अलॉन्ग विथ दिस बट दिस इज टोटली ऑप्शनल यू कैन ऑल्सो एड पटेटो विथ दिस इट इज रियली अमी विथ पटेटो नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू एड सम सॉल्ट बिकॉज आई डोंट एड सॉल्ट बिफोर बिकॉज समटाइम्स अ क्वान्टिटी चेंजेस वन इट्स ग्रीन वेजिटेबल दे रिड्यूज इन क्वान्टिटी सो वेन यू सी द क्वान्टिटी रिड्यूज क्वान्टिटी यू गेट द अप्रोप्रिएट मेजरमेंट ऑफ सॉल्ट सो आई प्रेफर आई आर ऑलवेज एडिंग इट इन दी एंड एंड नाउ एम पुटिंग अबाउट अ टी स्पून ऑफ सॉल्ट यू कैन एड एज पर योर टेस्ट मोर और लेस फॉर मी दिस मच इज इन टू साल्टी डोंट लाइक वेरी सॉल्टी I'll just cover it for another minute so that the lemon and beans get cooked and get its flavors. And we'll see after one or two minutes back. So uh, it's been more than a minute. I've kept the flame always on high, not too uh, low, because I don't want to oh, you know overcook this vegetable. But at the same time, cook it faster. And uh, if we keep it on lower flame for long time, it gets overcooked. and i don't want that that's why i'm doing this on medium high fever uh flame mm, it's like cook this doesn't get be really long to cook you know and when you open the cover you can reduce the flame to medium or lower than medium here you can add any masala you like I really don't like too many masalas with this uh, because it interferes flavors. Um, along with this, in the end, I add one more ingredient which is again optional. I will be crushing some peanuts, uh, roasted peanuts, or even you can use uh, salted peanuts if you already have them available. I'm using salted peanuts. So this vegetable goes really well with this um, salted peanut. powder i uh, don't really keep it coarse don't really make it fine powder it while it can taste good basically it will give you a nice crunch i have put the flame off because it's already nicely cooked this vegetable doesn't really take longer than 5 minutes i think so and it's cooked already you see oof it looks so yummy It's really delicious vegetable. I request you to try it at least once, and let me know how you liked it in comments. Please, if you are new to my channel, please like, share, and subscribe my channel. And so I'm using this um, masoor dal rice, and I'm going to serve this vegetable. So guys I hope you liked how I made this vegetable uh, please do give it a try and let me know in comments uh, whether you liked it or no it's definitely a very healthy and nutritious vegetable and really fibrous so it will definitely help you um, have a different taste in your daily uh, routine and um, I hope you like it uh, wait I'm going to taste it and tell you how it is mm. of course I make it always but um, I'm going to taste it with you. A little bit of rice and lots of vegetable. I like it. I like it because it's one of my favorite. and shallots and the 
peanuts, shallot peanuts and um edamame beans. Mm -hmm. One of my favorites. From the time I came in Switzerland. When I googled about it, I came to know it's one of the healthiest vegetables. It is something more similar to spring onions. Mm -hmm. But le less stronger. Uh, it's very milder taste than onions. And it's a little bit sweetish more than onions. So I hope you give it a try. I love it. I hope you love it too. Bye-bye. See you.